hello and welcome back to my channel this video is going to be a don't want to use the word typical it's going to be a day at work uh, for me I work in a church it is what is today it's Friday <laughs> today is Friday I actually have a lot to do today which isn't typical I usually don't have much to do Fridays, but I do have a lot to do today. So, I'm um, just gonna bring you along with me on my job in the church and kind of what I do here. But first, like I said earlier, I have a lot to do today, which is not typical. So what I'm gonna do is write everything down first. That's where I'm gonna start. And I'm going to use, this is a notepad that looks like slices of bread. Slices of bread. And this is stored in a dispenser that looks like a toaster. How cute is that? This is magnetic. magnetic and it has a pencil sharpener there was a technician here and I believe he needed the Wi-Fi I had to write something down for him and he needed the Wi-Fi I grabbed this and I wrote the Wi-Fi down and it literally it looks like bread like this looks like it looks like a piece of bread and so I wrote the Wi-Fi uh, password down for him and he looks at it and he looks at me, looks back at the note and looks at me and he just shook his head and left. And I don't know why I grabbed this because I do have regular, regular post-it notes. I have all kinds of notebooks and yeah, I don't know why I grabbed that one. I actually have another, I have this notebook, which is supposed to look like a stick of butter. But even these notes, I mean, these look, what is this? These notes, you know, this looks like just regular paper, but it is supposed to look like a stick of butter on a butter dish. I like cute things. I'm planning on doing a video of all of the things that I own for really no reason other than I thought they were cute. Okay, now to write down everything I need to do today. Most of it is in my phone. Okay, so I have written everything down. Um, I actually don't even, this is not even everything, but this is the important stuff. So I'm going to start with this stuff. Um, I have everything written down. So now what I'm going to do is make, oh, I'll have my coffee. I'm going to have my coffee and then I'll start work. I don't have my coffee yet, but this is where we're starting as far as cleaning my desk. So this is the start point. Hopefully by the end of the day, I can get all of this cleaned up. Um, and that over there, I don't even know what that is, honestly. This, this, I know what this stuff is. Usually on Fridays, I don't see too many people, so I wear my favorite shirt. It is Mothman, and so I hope I don't see anybody because I really don't feel like explaining. I don't feel like explaining Mothman. Okay, starting with the important things.
Okay, um, it's 10, 10, 15. I have been working for about an hour and a half. I was late today. I didn't get here until about 8.20, but I've been working for about an hour and a half. And now is usually when I would take a Sims break and I would play Sims for way too long, but I'm not going to take a Sims break today, at least not yet. What I'm going to do is start on the general Friday work. Um, I'm going to clean. I'm going to clean, which I don't want to do. I actually, oh, you know what? No, I do have something I need to work on that has a deadline which could have been yesterday, maybe today, maybe the 15th, I actually don't know. So I'm gonna work on that. The deadline is the 15th. I have been putting this off because it requires a ton of math which I don't want to do. Think I'm gonna take a break. I finished, I finished the report I needed to do. So that's done. So I think all I have left is I'm waiting for my boss to give me some numbers so that I can finish what I started this morning. And uh, let's see, I did the calendar, I did that. So yeah, I really just need to do that and then I can start on cleaning my desk, which this pile over here is actually going to be pretty easy to clean it's mostly filing um, but there is a very thick folder under there which had to do with the report that I already finished so I don't need the folder anymore so I can file that um, so yeah I'm gonna take a break for a couple hours I'll probably play Sims so it's 11:20. Take my lunch at 12. So probably from now till 1, I'll take a break. And then from 1 to 4, I'll clean my desk. Today is Saturday. I have a half day at work today. About yesterday, when I had lunch, my boss showed up. And then we started talking about food. And then we started watching the Food Channel. And then I went home early. So... After lunch, I didn't get anything done because I went home. So we are going to, well, not we. I am going to try to clean my desk today. That's the only thing I have to do. All the important stuff I did yesterday morning, luckily. So that's all done. So today I can just focus on cleaning my desk. This is what I'm working on cleaning right here. This area is really the main focus. And I have this pile that I'm already working on over here. to play my wordle so I'm gonna take a little break we have a three-day streak okay let's see what this word is I don't even know what this word means but I got it on the fourth guess 
I don't even know what that word means. That took me five minutes. Okay, let's see what that word means. Having an irritatingly strong and unpleasant taste or smell. Acrid. Okay, I was saying it right in my head. Okay, back to work. One thing about this job, I've been here for four years. I started in 2019. Um, when I got interviewed, I mean, the pastor told me I was going to have a lot of downtime, which was cool. It was cool at first. But then I kind of started getting bored. So we have, for the most part, one busy day in the office. Like, it's the day where we do everything. Uh, every week and so what I had started doing because basically my week starts Tuesdays so Tuesday I was getting ready for Wednesday Wednesday was the busy day Thursday Friday and Saturday I didn't have anything to do because everything was done Wednesday so what I started doing was I started to not finish everything on Wednesday so I'd have something to do Thursday and so I just started putting off more and more work and so now that's why I have all of this filing to do because I stopped doing it Wednesdays when I would do everything else. So I'd have something to do the rest of the week. And then it just kind of got away from me. So there's plenty, plenty to file. This right here is most recent, but I have plenty of other stuff that I need to get to filing just from weeks where I was trying to stretch my work. One of my favorite things about this job, and it has been for a long time, is how much, how much I'm by myself. Like I, I'm by myself so much here, and I love that I'm watching, I'm watching cartoons. I would say I get a lot of work done, but I don't. I don't. Do play a lot of Sims, though. So, now it's time to file these, which is going to take a lot of time. So, what I'm going to do is put this stuff in the file cabinet. Okay, so I am making great time. Um, I really only have some filing to do, and then this little corner is clean. So I did what I wanted to, and I'm excited because I've actually been trying to clean my desk for I don't even know how many months. If I would just file and put the stuff away when I was supposed to it'd be done but I have about two and a half more hours so I'm going to spend that filing this stuff I was talking about my butter notes and my toast notes yesterday I got I got some new notes I got ramen notes I haven't opened them yet but they look like a pack of ramen noodles there are cooking instructions on the back let's see oh, 
here they are they just look like noodles I don't know why I enjoy this stuff but I do Another thing that I have to do is fill out these forms for bills that we've paid and that's also something that I do Wednesdays well that I'm supposed to do Wednesdays that I don't do so now I have to go through as I'm filing it away I have to go through the system to find the ones that I didn't fill out the form for because some I do have but um, it's looking like most of them I don't, which means I'm probably not going to finish cleaning today because I have to go through and do these forms for a lot of this stuff. Okay, so today has actually been pretty productive. Um, I, for the most part, have cleared up that little... Um, corner on my desk so I'm not done but it's for the most part it's clear so really all I'm focusing on now is filing um so what I'll do is keep filing on Tuesday and then by Wednesday I'll have more to file but um, today was very productive. I got a, I got a lot done. I got a lot done and really what's taking the most time is going through the system and making sure that all of the things in the system have a paper form attached to it and just writing, filling out those forms takes so much time, but I don't have, whoops. I don't have too much left to do. It is um, 11.30, so I'm cleaning up. I'm done working for the day. This is what it looks like as of, um, 11.30. For the most part, that little corner is clean. Um, this is clean. So I think maybe because I, I do have a lot to do other than like the regular work stuff. So maybe I'll make this a series of cleaning my desk because I do have a ton of stuff. Like all of this, this is all mail that I have to open and go through. So. I have plenty to do and I think having the camera here like almost gives me the sense of body doubling. If you don't know what body doubling is, while you're working and there's someone else around, like you don't have to be talking to that person and you, you could be working on two completely different things, but having another person around really helps you focus. Um, or when people go to work in public places like coffee shops and public libraries or parks just to have other people around so it's easier to focus because when you're by yourself you probably wouldn't get as much work done. I think the camera does give me a sense of body doubling which is very helpful because I have been trying to clear that corner for at least two months. At least two months. So yeah i might make this a series just so maybe i can finally get my desk clean today and yesterday were productive and i'm happy with the work i did on another note i have some pop figures on my desk um i am by no means a collector i do not collect them i buy the ones that i like so i'm just gonna say that now i don't think i have any from the same set or anything like that i buy the ones that i like let me give you a quick tour of my pop figures we are starting with alexander hamilton 
when Hamilton was put on Disney Plus, I was obsessed. Obsessed. I love Hamilton. Next, we have Miss Marvel, Miss Kamala Khan. Um, I loved this show. I thought it was so cute. Um, I like the story. I didn't know anything about her before watching Miss Marvel on Disney Plus, but I thought it was a great show. And then we have Harry Potter, and he has he has a bottle of Skelligro and a broken arm. This is um, from a scene in the Chamber of Secrets where he gets hit by a rogue bludger playing Quidditch. Next up we have Next up we have Princess Tiana um, with a pot of gumbo. Uh, she's my favorite princess, so she is the only princess I have. And then we have Hulk. We have Hulk from Endgame, and he has tacos. There's a scene in Endgame where he has tacos. I believe they are from Del Taco. Behind Hulk, we have Alligator Loki, which is another show I liked. Um, this Loki, when I saw Alligator Loki, I was like, yeah. I'm gonna need that pop figure. The funny thing is I got on Amazon and it was like $70. And something told me to go to Hot Topic. So I go to hottopic.com and it was regular price, like $14.99. And then I had some like, uh, what do they call them? Hot Cash or Hot Topic. Anyway, I had Hot Topic coupons. I got this thing for like $5.99. I would have been so mad if I paid $70. And these two, the other ones are really nothing but decoration, but these two hold up all of this stuff <laughs> on my desk. So they're the only two that actually have a job um, and really have a purpose. Lastly, I have Dwight Schrute. He was actually the first one that I bought and he has the stapler. I don't know if you can see it. He has the stapler and the jello. Yeah, so that is my pop desk tour. Um, as you saw, none of them are from a set. Like, generally, you have the ones that make up a whole collection, so you would get the other ones. No, I buy the ones I like. I probably have five more pops at home. I have Sweet D from It's Always Sunny. Um, I have Namor from Black Panther. I have another Harry Potter, but it doesn't go to that set. It's a Christmas Harry. It's a limited edition Christmas one that I got like three years ago. Um, I have an Appa from Avatar The Last Airbender, and I have a Pride Tina Belcher. So it's like a rainbow Tina from Bob's Burgers, which if you don't watch Bob's Burgers, it's a great show. You really should. It is my favorite show. <laughs> It's a great show. If you're not watching Bob's Burgers, you need to watch Bob's Burgers. Um, it's on Hulu. And I think that is it for the day. Thank you for watching.